back with another Vlogmas video. I'm here with Xavi and Yega. And we are going today to the Swedish Christmas market. I, I was reading online, I'll put the website below. Basically, something that they have there is called Glog. So I'm gonna have to try that. That's like the first thing that I wanna see. Cause it sounds kinda like eggnog. I'm thinking that it's like a holiday drink, you know? It's a milkshake, man. Glog milkshake brings all the boys to the yard. The Swedish boys. <laughs> it's the Sweden boys to the yard. So the event is happening at Harbor Square, um, Harbor Front Center, downtown Toronto. I'm already seeing some people that are wearing what looks to be traditional Swedish Christmas wear. <laughs> I don't know about this event today. <laughs> what would you say brought you here? Um, I read online that there was going to be glog. Yes. I don't yes. know what that is, and I want to try it. <laughs> yeah, um, it's a Swedish drink that we have. It's like a, you serve it warm, uh -huh. um, sort of at Christmas time. So like okay. it's sort of like, like a, a holiday dirty drink. hot chocolate. Like, oh, <laughs> like, oh. Um, the sweet, that's how the Swedes <laughs> get now, right? Dirty yeah. hot it's chocolate. Warm. Yeah, it's warm. I like it. Um, and then you yeah, can get it with like our traditional, um, like, Cinnamon buns, cinnamon, like okay. buns. Cool. So yeah, it's in the cafe. It's all in the cafe? Yeah. All right. <laughs> okay. Thanks. Yeah. I'm looking for the glog. The glog is uh, in the hallway on the way to the lakeside terrace. So it's like terrace perfect. Have, uh, the and stuff like that there. Okay, okay, perfect. Thank you. Thank you. We're going to find this glog. Uh, in that room, they were selling like cheese and all this other kind of stuff. I'm pretty sure it was all homemade, maybe. It looked like it. I think I think we found the Glog. <gasps> I found a Glog. Okay. Ideally, if you're making at home, you add a little rum to it. Or vodka. Now it's basically red wine that is mild wine with sugar and orange wine. So that's vlog. We're gonna try this uh, out on the terrace. We're gonna take it and see how we like our vlog. There's a huge lineup. We have to come out to the terrace. Actually, glock. It's not glock like a gun. 
It's glad like a drink. Like so, a drink. and the pepper, the pepper coca, which is a cookie. Um, this is very traditional Sweden stuff. Like the Swedes were in there, they were like, this is what every Sweden drinks for holidays. Like this is some good stuff. This is what I love about Toronto. It's so diverse and there's so many things that you can get to see and do and you know, you're just learning about all different types of cultures that you would never interact with normally. In the Caribbean, I know that around holiday time, they do, you know, rum cake or um, sorrel. That's a that's a big thing. But normally the rum rum fruit cake, and they like they soak the fruit in the rum for months before holiday season. And these rum cakes are like big. So this sound is this drink is similar to. <laughs> Well, we're gonna see how we like it. Apparently it's like red wine, so let's try it. You wanna try some? <laughs> you gonna try it first? Apparently you gotta let the almonds soak in it. <laughs> That's really sweet. <laughs> it's good. Yeah, it's just like warm red wine. <laughs> oh, it tastes like sarsaparilla. Sa like Similar to yeah. sarsaparilla? Yeah, it tastes like that. You want to try it? <laughs> it's like warm red wine. It's really nice. And I'm going to dip the cookie. The, oh, cook, the cookie. The cookie. <laughs> no, uh, sorry. <laughs> pepper coca. Yeah, yeah. Pepper coca. Oh, bottom of the cookie fell off inside the red wine. Yo, the cookie is like banana bread. Try it. Dip it and try it. Here. It's like a piece of banana banana bread. Isn't that nice? It has like a ginger snap taste to it too. Yeah, but it's like, like banana bread. bread. It's really sweet. Okay, get it. Ooh, this red wine is strong. <laughs> Glog. So, I think the highlight right now is the Glog. I'm feeling it. How comfy is it? It's really good. Yeah? <laughs> it's better than sitting on the cold cement, right? Yeah. <laughs> you gotta try the glog in there. Oh, I already did. It's so yeah, good. it's really good. It's my first of the season. Did so. you try it with the pepper coca? No. The cookie? Ouch. No, it tastes it's like, like banana stuff. bread. Oh, really? Yeah, you think it's a ginger oh, cookie, but it's like... Surprise! <laughs> good to know. Have yeah. a good day, guys. You too. Right, same to you. So you're over your, your fire, you're over your fire having a glog. Just, yeah. Ooh, he was right. This is super soft. 
I can get used to this. The outdoor living? Yeah, the streets living the high life. <laughs> the warm glog, you know. Nice, real animal fur here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> hey there. How's it going, guys? Hello. Hi. What's your favorite part of the fair so far? My favorite part of the fair. Yeah. Like which one specifically? I got for the meatball. The Swedish meatball. See? The meat on the open face sandwich. Okay. Yeah. And have you been here before? Like this is your the fourth time? Fourth time coming to the Swedish Christmas fair. I have a lot of in-laws that are Swedish. Oh. oh. He's Sounds good. Swedish. The, Swedish? <laughs> <laughs> the glog is really so, good. Like I don't like glog. <laughs> We're here for you. <laughs> what do you guys like about the fair? This, this, oh, this, this is my first time coming here. This is the, so, this is the first time they've had this. Oh, yeah, the, the Sami stuff is new. Yeah, oh. is it like the native yeah, the uh, indigenous, indigenous people, people in uh -huh. Sweden? Yeah, Sweden and Finland. Oh. Okay, that's really cool. The reindeer people, the Laplanders. So they all have like colorful, you'll see, you'll, the woman in there is, looks like it. Uh, she's got like the Laplander clothes on. It's all bright red okay. and mm -hmm. like, you know, tasseled. So I'm here with... Ellen. Ellen? Yeah. Uh, and she's wearing her traditional uh, Sammy. Sammy dress. Yeah. Uh, uh, just like in the tent that we saw outside. Uh, the, what do they call it, Tiki? Lavo. Lavo. Yeah. Okay. So it's a traditional lavo that they've set up outside. Um, and she's here, she's in the traditional dress, and she was just telling me about some Swedish candy. Yeah, you have to try Swedish yeah. candy. The so what? The one with salt. Oh, with salt? <laughs> yeah. So what, what type of candy? Is it sold over there? Yeah. Okay, I'll, I'll have to grab one. What is it called? Uh, the Swedish candy. Salt lockrits. Salt. Say it again. Salt lockrits. Salt lockrits. Yeah. Okay. That's very special. Okay. I'm gonna have to try that. Yeah. Um, thank you so yeah, much, Ellen. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Um, it's really nice to like see what other cultures do for the holiday season. Like, they have their own customs, their own culture, and um, it was really nice to be a part of that. Uh, I just met my girl Ellen. She actually hooked me up with this handmade Swedish leather bracelet. You know, it was a nice Christmas gift from, from the Swedes. I like black liquor, so it's not bad. Now we out. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Watch my other videos. Um, the other Christmas Christmas market video is really, you know, it's good. The videos will be out every Friday, every Wednesday of December. So make sure you go and check it. Check it out. Where did we park? Was it T2? I thought so too.